Hi, Kim. Hi. Could you tell your name and the brief background? Yeah, my name is Kim Harvey. Um, I'm semi-retired, 60 years old, and um, I'm enjoying my life at the moment. What inspires you for your artwork? Um, all sorts of things inspire me. Um, being an abstract artist, um, I'm pretty lucky because anything can look good to me. Um, it may not look good to other people, but it certainly looks good to me. This particular one here was a mistake. I actually uh, dropped the paint pot over and it ran onto the canvas and, and then I added some, some black and some red and it, that's how it came out and it came out very well in the end. I was very pleased with that. Um, it's, it's, yeah, it's yeah. How long have you been painting or doing artwork? Um, well, for as long as I can remember. Um, just recently, you know, I've, I've actually gone into mosaics um, using tiles um, and now I'm actually using children's hammer beads um, and you know, I've gotten some quite good results from that and some uh, nice feedback from it. Uh, yeah, I, I missed out on using hammer beads when I was a kid but I'm making up for it now. <laughs> that was a Steve McQueen one. Yeah, yeah. What is your favourite art medium? I, I tend to you know, change about a bit. Um, sometimes I, I have a, a run of uh, tile mosaics, so I, I get a few inspirations and I think, yes, I've got to do that, I've got to do that, I've got to do that. And then I read a book on abstract art and I think, oh, yeah, I've got to get back into a bit of abstract. And, you know, it, it, it varies. There's no real medium that I use, you know, whatever. Being an abstract artist, I can use anything. What is your favourite style of abstract? Once again, you know, um, it, it's, it's on the day. If I feel I want to do abstract, then I'll do abstract. If I feel that you know, I've got a few things to do in, in tiles, I'll do them in tiles. It's, there's no set rule with my art. It's how I feel on the day. Yeah. Yeah. What do you want to express or achieve through your artwork? Oh. That's a, that's a difficult question because uh, every artist will tell you something different. But for me, to get a reaction from someone about my artwork, if it's good or bad, it doesn't bother me because if I want a reaction and someone says it's rubbish, then that's a compliment because I've actually achieved a reaction from someone. Um, fortunately, most of my work gets you know, a good um, liking, should we say. Um, but there are occasions where people say to me, oh, that's rubbish, that's rubbish. But it doesn't matter. Of course, yeah, that's it. And do you have another hobby or interest? Uh, yeah, I love gardening. Um, uh, I do, <laughs> it may not look like it at the moment, but I'm going to start getting myself fit again. I used to do a lot of running at one time. So um, I'd like to get back into that, but not into the marathon running. But yeah, I've got time now to do other things and uh, yeah, cycling. I do a bit of cycling. Yeah. That's great. What is your future project? Once again, it, it all depends. I, I think these hammer beads are getting quite a lot of uh, you know good reports on them. Um, you can achieve quite a lot of um, uh, detail in the hammer beads, and um, I think that may be the future. Um, the tiles take a little bit longer to do and they're messy and I can only do them in the summer because I'm not allowed in the house with them um, and so, so same with the paint if I'm frying paint around I've got to go outside into the, into what I call my studio and um, but the hammer beads can be done anywhere in the house no mess no fuss so I think that might be the, uh, the way to go at the moment. thank you Wait. Thank you. <laughs>